Kane, I'm moving in on Rucker's position. You got those coordinates yet? I'll transmit them as soon as I've finished my coffee. Don't leave me hanging, Chicane. You just worry about getting our man. And be careful. He's dangerous. We'll see. I'm sure you'll understand if I don't take your word for it. As the customary final request of the condemned man, please, do not kill any more of my people on your way out. Their only crime against you is their loyalty to me. You don't seem surprised to see me. I'm not. After the train station attacks, I knew it was only a matter of time before they sent someone. Please, sit. This isn't a social call, Rucker. I'm here to take you in. Our mandate is to fight for the rights of the Augmented. Communicate our message, offer assistance. The Ark is a non-violent organization. All right, then this should be easy. Come with me, answer our questions, and we'll have you back here in plenty of time to film your next sermon. I'm not a fool. If I surrender now, I'm never coming back. Once you have me, you intend to make me disappear. But I will not make Solzhenitsyn's mistake. My people and I will resist you. I thought you were a pacifist. I am. But I am more than a leader. I am a symbol. That is why you wish to erase me. If martyrdom is the only way to remain a symbol, then even my death is preferable to my evaporation you said you don't want any more of your people getting hurt but if i have to bring you in by force i will and they're gonna try to stop me there's a better chance of avoiding violence if you come along peacefully you have my word i will do everything i can to see that you're treated fairly how dare you speak to me of peace and fairness you assaulted innocent people to get in here and kidnap me on behalf of masters who hide in the shadows, manipulating, controlling, and murdering without the courage to proclaim their convictions in front of the rest of the world. I am talking to you about playing straight. Me. Alone. No politicians, no cameras. Groups of people can't be trusted, only individuals. Do I really have to explain that to you? No, you do not. And you certainly don't need to do it in that patronizing tone. The Augmented are suffering a genocide. It begins with demonizing us, taking away our rights, treating us as less than human, exiling us so we are forgotten, and then exterminating us. I know all that. It's happening to me too. But I am out here actively trying to stop the killing on both sides. What are you accomplishing by filming speeches? I thought that logic and reason would be enough. I had faith that the non-augmented would come to their senses given time. But it's become clear I have to do more. There's so much work I have to do. I am beset by the bombings on one side, and arc internal politics on the other, and it may be that the two are connected. I have to regroup, to decide what is best for me and for the cause. I need you to delay my arrest, if just for a day.
Things are bad everywhere. And the longer it drags on, the worse they'll get. The best thing for you and the cause is to show strong leadership by coming in now, proudly and willingly, to help fix things. Yes. I suppose you are right. My time here has all but run out. Can you understand this? If you were to take me from here, you would be responsible for more than my death. You'd be responsible for my effacement, the ruination of the Augmented Rights Coalition, and the perversion of everything it stands for. I understand that you're exaggerating. The cause is millions of people around the world, not just one man. Look past the fear of your own death. Nobody's gonna risk making a martyr out of you. I was not talking about my death. I was talking about the lies that would follow afterwards. The lies that will be spread by the people who sent you here. If you cannot see this, then you are too blind for me to trust you. I will not come with you. And that is final. Do what you must. While you're deciding, ask yourself this. What possible reason could I have for being involved in these terrorist attacks? With every incident, the gap of fear and hatred that divides Orgs and non-Orgs widens. Who really benefits when innocents die? Allegedly in the name of Og rights. That's a good question. And a dangerous one. If you ask it too loudly in this place. Somewhere down there, hiding in plain sight, is your real terrorist. I was trying, secretly, to find out who is responsible. Rucker? A lot of heat coming through the door. I need a way out now. You fucked it, didn't you? Now, Chicane. Relax, there's some greenhouses near your position. Below them is a clearing. You can't miss it. I'm already on my way. Chicane out.
feed my imagination. Or something. My friends, this most recent act of senseless violence has been laid at our feet. At the feet of all augmented. Not simply armed. And I fear the repercussions will test our resolve. The strength of our convictions. We have been cast as the villain once again. Find you! I'm going to kill you! I'm ready for anything! I'm going to find you! Not right. This is not right. I don't like this. Make sure this area is clear before moving on. Here. Stay vigilant. We can fight him! There! 